hi guys welcome back to my channel and today i have for you guys my october's favorites um i have a couple products here that i want to show you guys that i've been loving for the month of october okay now the first thing that i have for you guys is a palette and it is what i am wearing on my eyes right now and it is the anastasia's um self-made palette that just recently launched i think maybe two weeks ago and I just got mine maybe about a week ago. But ever since I've got this palette, I have not been able to put it down. So rich the and pigmented and buttery, like just like any of her other shadows. And it comes with the mirror, as usual. And it also comes with the brush. Now this palette comes with 14 shadows instead of the 12. And I think that's why it retails for the $35. But beyond the $35, this palette is worth every penny when I say that. Um, like I said, the colors in here are very buttery, and I did use it on my eyes today. I used Deep Purple um, Champagne Pop in the inner portion of my eye, and then the Deep Purple on the outside, and I also used Sorbet and um, Hot Chocolate in the crease, and I also used Buttery as my brow bone highlight. And like I said, ever since I've gotten been, this palette, I have not been able to put it down. If you haven't got this palette, go ahead and pick this up now and if you wanted me to do a full review or in-depth review and if you want me to do other looks or if you want me to recreate this look again just comment down below and I will get that up for you guys so if you have any looks any questions about this palette just comment down below and I'll be sure to answer you guys and so my next product now I've been asking about this product for a while now and I was contemplating on getting it and I'm late on the bandwagon and I can't believe I didn't get this and it product. Smashbox Primer Water. I just picked this up and everybody's been raving about it. Every review um, and everything that I saw on YouTube, everybody was raving about it. So I finally picked it up and when I say I'm in love, like I am in love with this product and as you can see I've, I have been using quite a bit. but. I really love the way, I don't know if it's me, but it kind of makes it, when I spray it on, the, the smell is refreshing, like it's not, it doesn't have like a, a distinct smell, but it's kind of fresh smelling, kind of, you know, and silicone free, alcohol free, and oil free, so that's great, I mean, I don't have oily skin, but that's great, and um, when I spray it on, I just feel like it kind of makes this, um, not sticky, but makes this base, kind of thing for my foundation to adhere to and when I put it on like everything is smooth um, I really like this primer and I wish I would have got this sooner but if you have this and you love this hit the like button because I am so in love with this and I'm finally happy that I finally picked this up and the next product that I want to talk about well it's not a product it's a brush Elf angle brush and it just looks like this and it's just this angle brush and I got this from like Walmart for three dollars and um I've had this for a long time and as you guys know I don't too much wear blush but I've been trying to incorporate brush in my makeup routines and I finally found the brush I, I didn't know would. how to use the brush that I previously had but I finally found a brush that I like that can uh, really apply the blush and as you guys can see I have on blush today and I am loving this look and I just place it on and I just blend it back just like this and it just blends wonderfully it blends the product out nice and i figure you can also use this for contour as well since it has that angle that angle slant to it so i've really been loving this brush and like i said it's by elf and I, it was three dollars so um the next thing i want to talk about is some lashes and i got these lashes for really cheap i never really seen these lashes anywhere i got these lashes from my my workplace and um or i think and they just look like this i've been wearing them in my um my latest tutorials that i've been doing i've been rocking these lashes and i really love these lashes and it says um I'm trying to see where it says because I've used these multiple multiple times I've I've cleaned them I've washed them I did them multiple times and nothing is happening to them there's no shredding there's no um, the glue band is not you know 
coming off or dissolving these lashes are the bomb I wish they had well I know they have some but I just have to find some more um, natural ones that I can wear every day because I'm not rocking these every day as you can see these are really really dramatic I use Most these for my dramatic makeup days but I've really been loving these and I got three boxes and this is uh, I still have this one in another box that I haven't even opened yet and I still have the lashes that I already used and they're still like brand new uh, next so um two items I want to talk about is what I have on my lips and it's just a combo of two um lipsticks that I've been wearing wearing and one is the NYX um liquid suede yeah liquid suede lipstick and I have this one in the color sandstorm and then the next one that I mix it with is the matte not flat velvet lipsticks from um LA girl and then this is the color da, 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 da. this is the color snuggle and then like I said this is the color sandstorm and I've really been loving these two together I'll give you guys a swatch of this one and like it almost blends into my skin but I really like it and there's a swatch over there and I just line it with a brown yeah. lip liner it seems to work out fine and then this one is just like that and I'll just swatch it next to it is almost the same color but just a little bit darker and I just top the sandstorm off with this one just to give me that little color so it doesn't look like I have concealer lips because don't nobody want concealer lips I don't know about y'all but I don't want concealer lips and so I've really really been loving these two products um, I've been wearing them when I don't want to wear too much lipstick I've been adhering to these so I've been loving these if you don't have the NYX suede any of them go and pick some up I recommend this color um, every time I go to my Ulta or to anywhere I'm not Sephora Ulta and I've tried to see if maybe like um, a beauty supply has them but nobody has them so I got them from Ulta if you don't have them go and try some out and my next product that I want to talk about is what also what I'm wearing on my eyes and it's this mascara that I have and it's it's I feel like it's old but it's like new to me and it's it's in a sample size I got it and it's the Urban Decay Perversion uh, mascara really been liking this mascara like um the wand's not too big but i kind of like it when it's big and it can really 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 coat more of the lashes and sometimes i choose this i've been choosing this over my better than sex mascara and y'all know i love my better than sex mascara but this one um i might be thinking about getting the full but size i'm not for sure yet but if you guys have any comments or anything about this um, mascara, comment down below and let me know what you think of it so I can go and get the full size. And the next thing what I want to talk about is the powder that I've been wearing on my face. I've been trying to get my L'Oreal True Match um, Powder Arrest. Even though I picked up a backup, I'm still just trying to um, give it a rest because as you guys know, I have hit pan on it and it's almost trying to give that a rest so, yeah. and so then I started you back using this is when I first 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 started wearing makeup like in high school like back in the day in high school I used to use this covergirl powder and it's just like this this powder and the reason why I stopped using it is because I noticed that there's a lot of glitter particles in there and I don't want that glitter all over my face so um I just I don't know I just kind of started going back to it and I like now I have it on my face and like I really don't see any of that glitter particles in it but I really been loving it and this is the color translucent honey and like I said it's just it's just this powder kind of shape form and I don't know why but I like the way it smells it smells kind of powdery but I've really been loving this and I've been using this over my L'Oreal to try to give that a rest but as you can see, you cannot tell that I have any glitter particles other than this highlight. Now, everybody know I'm about the highlight life. So the highlight is on fleek, but I've really been loving this. And then the next thing I want to talk about is what I use to um, do my highlighting, my concealing under my eyes. Pro Conceal. And I've been up on the color be medium beige, and I've been using this to really highlight under my eye. Lately, I've been about that bright in your face under eye highlights and this has been giving it to me with my uh, banana powder that I've been using lately also but this and that together is the best combination ever for an under under eye highlight if you really like it highlighted the, these two 
we'll get it just done i've really been liking this and then the next product that I want to talk about is um, Dramatic Black. And I did a video, and then I'll link down below, um, Smoky Eye, a classic black Smoky Eye. And I use this. And I haven't been really on to these, but I really like the consistency of this. I really like how the eyeshadow adhered to this when I applied this first as a base. And then I put my black. I really love how that came out. And, um... If you have any of these, list down below or comment down below some colors that you think I should pick up that I would like. Um, I have I have this one and then I got, I think, a uh, taupe color and I think, um, what is the other color? A uh, beige color. But this one I've really been using for my smoky eyes. Um, I've been wearing a lot of smoky eyes and I've just been using this for that. So like that looks all like all my favorites. Um, if you guys like this video, go ahead and hit the like button. And thanks for all my subscribers that I have. I'm almost at 100. I know we can do it. Um, if you're not subscribed, thanks for clicking on this video. Go ahead and hit the subscribe button. And I welcome you. And I love all my subscribers that I have. And I really appreciate you guys. You guys, uh, I'm really just happy to start, been started this YouTube journey. And the feedback and the amount of subscribers that I have lets me know that you guys are liking my videos and I want you guys to comment down below some looks that you want to see some videos that you guys want me to get up um, just anything like that I'm I want to talk to you guys I want to you know get videos out for you guys so if you guys could comment down below what you want to see and anything like that I would greatly appreciate it so until next Sunday guys I'll see you in the next video